Hello everyone and welcome you all to Quick Solutions for All India Cash Test Series Medical 2020. Today I am going to take up the zoology part of the paper, test paper number 2, code A and B in zoology. So let's get started with our very first question. Question number 136, choose the odd one with respect to viral venereal disease and the options given are genital herpes, hepatitis B, genital warts, gonorrhea and the correct answer to this question is option number 4, gonorrhea because gonorrhea is a bacterial disease caused by bacterium Neisseria. gonorrhea. bacteria whereas rest of the options like option number one genital herpes is caused by herpes simplex virus so this cannot be a correct answer hepatitis b is caused by hbv or hepatitis b virus so this is incorrect and the third option genital warts is caused by human papilloma virus so this is also an incorrect option and the correct answer to this question is option number four human papilloma virus let's discuss the next question question number 137 in a normal healthy woman periodic abstinence as a method of contraception is practiced during days of menstrual cycle choose the option that fills the blank correctly and the options given are 1 to 7 10 to 12 18 to 21 21 to 27 and the correct answer to this question is option number two during periodic abstinence, couples abstain from coitus from day 10 to 17 of menstrual cycle when ovulation is expected, whereas rest of the options are incorrect. So, the correct answer to this question is option number 2. Let's discuss the next question, which is question number 138. An IUD, intrauterine device that can increase phagocytosis of sperms in the uterus and suppress sperm motility is. And the options given are multi-load 375, progesta LNG20, lipis loop. And the correct answer to this question is option number 1, multi-load 375. It is a copper containing IUD. Copper ions present in these copper releasing IUDs suppress sperm motility and fertilizing capacity of sperms. On the other hand, option number 2 and option number 3 is incorrect because these are hormone releasing IUDs. Whereas option number 4 is incorrect, it is an inert IUD. So, the correct answer to this question is option number 1. Let's move on to the next question. Question number 139, which of the following is not effective for emergency contraception after coitus? And the options given are only progestogen pills, progestogen estrogen pills, only estrogen pills and intrauterine devices IUDs. And the correct answer to this question is option number 3, only estrogen pills. Estrogen alone is not effective to carry out the function of emergency contraception. Whereas progesterone prevent ovulation and implantation and alter the quality of cervical mucus, which does not let sperms meet the ovum. So option number 1, 2, are incorrect options and option number four intrauterine devices as used as effective method for emergency contraception after coitus so this cannot be a correct answer and the correct answer to this question is option number three let's move on to the next question question number 140 corrective treatment for infertile couples has become possible because of and the options given are mtp art rch STI and the correct answer to this question is option number 2 ART or assisted reproductive technologies infertile childless couples could be assisted to have children through special techniques known as assisted reproductive techniques or art. 
a popular method is test tube baby program let's discuss rest of the options the next option is mtp and this is incorrect mtp stands for medical termination of pregnancy the next option is rch this is incorrect rch stands for reproductive and child health care whereas sti is an incorrect option because sti stands for sexually transmitted infection so the correct answer to this question is option number 2 let's move on to the next question mm -hmm. 